sample 11. In the figure shown, determine AX and AY for the pressure at A, B, and C to be the same. Then if AY is 0, determine AX for the pressure at A and C to be the same. Then if AX is 4.5 meters per second square, determine the positive value of AY for the pressure at A and C to be the same. So for the first, let's look at the figure. Uh, we know that the pressure at A is always 0. Then without motion, the pressure at, pressure at B and C the pressures at B and C will be negative because uh, they are above and uh, zero pressure level is through A. So for them to be the same, all the three to be the same, AX should be zero because it can affect the surface of equal pressure. And AY should be negative of G for it to be the same. So pressure at A is always zero. So therefore, AX must be zero so that it cannot affect the surface, which will not make all the pressure at A, B, and C to be the same. So the analysis is AY should be zero so that the pressure at B and C will be zero. So to prove that the pressure at B and C will also be zero if AY is, AY is negative G rather, then the pressure at B is specific weight of water 9.81 this is 0.5 so it is above so 9.81 times negative 0.5 times quantity 1 plus ay over g but ay should be negative g so that 1 plus negative g over g is 0 so that pressure at b is 0 same is true for c 9.81 times negative 0.5 times 1 minus 1 plus negative g over g so that's why it's 0 so the answer ax is 0 and ay is negative g for the second question for the pressure at a and c to be the same because the pressure at a is always 0 because it is exposed to the atmosphere the surface imaginary surface should cross c also so that the pressure at c will be 0 like that so we will call the angle here as theta. So tangent theta is AX over G. And it is also equal to 0.5. This is 0.5 over 1.5. So AX therefore is G over 3 or 9.81 over 3. So AX is 3.27 meters per second square. And finally for... 11.3, if AX is 4.5 meters per second square, determine the positive value of AY for the pressure at A and C to be the same. So still, the because there is AY and we're looking for the positive value, this is still the resulting surface so that the pressure at C is zero. So there's no head. And the formula for tangent theta is AX over G plus ay this time and it is also equal to 0.5 over 1.5 so ax is given 4.5 over 9.81 plus ay equals one third so therefore ay is 3 times 4.5 minus 9.81 and that is 3.69 meters per second square so that's it for this problem